What's going on guys, this is Ghoul Scout, and uh, yeah, Rogue Company just kind of dropped this update real quick. Was not expecting to wake up to have a glimpse this soon, but she's out. Uh, also, there's some new items in the shop, not too much, but we've got that new Gundam looking secret skin in there, along with the skin for Glimpse. Uh, we'll get to secret in a second, but Glimpse is out. She's got the camouflage ability along with the heightened senses, now called Slighty. Um, she rocks the AK and the SMG class. And I've only used her in one match so far. Wanted to get this out real quick. Planning on live streaming a little bit later today. Also, the newer mastery level items have not been added into the game yet. That will be in a future update. But we did get some of the quality of life and balance changes in this update, along with all the changes that they mentioned for the different weapon classes, with some getting nerfs and buffs to certain things. Um, that information's out there, so if you want to check that out. But Vi did get her passive changed. Much needed. She'll be a much better choice now with the leeching rounds. So now, her passive kind of acts a lot like how cannons works, where instead of it being ammo that's replenished from hitting with your gun, you now get health added to you. So it's a mixture of cannon along with how her ability used to work with her vile poison. But yeah, so uh, let's get into Glimpse a bit. So as I said, Glimpse has the AKs along with, or the ARs along with the SMGs. She also has the new pop smoke grenade that deploys immediately when she tosses it out. And she also has that newer perk, Hunter, that came with Umbra, the last update. A quick and dirty kind of guide to countering her is... EMP grenades and glitch, along with anyone that has access to any sort of reveal abilities, you know, your sticky sensors and things of that nature, because her cloaking ability is, uh, she's not immune to reveals. The three dots that you see there on the screen when she's cloaked, it shows how invisible she is, so if it's three dots on the screen, then you should be, for the most part, completely invis or invisible to your enemies, whereas two dots is kind of invisible, kind of hard to see. One dot is they can basically see you. As you can see, when she's moving quickly, it's one dot, and she has that kind of effect over her. Now she's got the three dots because she's moving slowly and is basically invi invisible. On top of that, she does have her passive, which doesn't show up here in the shooting range, but I'll swap over to some actual gameplay. As you saw right there, that was her passive ability, that little pain that just happened. So, it doesn't matter how many people are nearby you, if they're nearby, every once in a while you'll get a notification showing you the general direction of where they are at. Um, also, a little side note is that you are able to go into her cloaking ability when you are downed. So this will help you out with whenever you need a teammate to revive you and things of that nature. Uh, also you are able to revive teammates when you are cloaked. Uh, super helpful. But yeah, so that's about it. I will be live streaming later today, uh, trying to get in some games with her along with probably playing Glitch since he's my main, doing some counterplays against her. 
And yeah, hopefully I will catch you guys in my stream. And if you like my content, please like and subscribe. I'm really trying to grow up my channel. And that's about it. See ya.